Let's jump into some 100 Baby for today. To start off today's episode, we need to give Banana a CC makeover. Banana is a teenager now, so we've got to pop some CC on her. I'm a bit confused where her yellow head came from, considering she's bald and has red skin. But let's quickly <laughs> make our way through this CC makeover so we don't have to stare at her for too long because the red is quite, like, garish. It's a lot for the old eyes to have to deal with. I don't think it's a skin detail. No. Oh, it was something. Wait, what was it? It was an accessory. Hold on, what was causing that? It was something in accessories. <laughs> what was causing that? I've no idea, but I got rid of it and now it's back. Wait, go back. I have no idea. You drink pretty much only fruit teas, all kinds. Currently I have banana, pineapple and lemon, raspberry and pomegranate, strawberry and gooseberry and a regular berry one. Oh, your favourite's not sold anymore? Coffee, flavoured coffee. Uh, I haven't tea in 32 years, really, Marche? Just because it's a new month doesn't mean I won't continue my chaos. Thank you, Dragon. I really appreciate that. Thank you for supporting like that. Um, no worries, Simscheme. Enjoy your lunches. Um, oh, yeah. Thank you. You're an absolute star. Thank you for helping out with that. I wouldn't be, be able to keep up with, <laughs> with the spreadsheet and everything on top. So um, thank you for that. Thank you for helping. Carlin, thank you for that luck as well, darling. I was considering bringing Nelly up for stream today, but I just don't trust her in this room. I think off stream, I need to have her in this room like more. And then maybe we'll get to the point where she can hang out. We're just not there at the moment, I'm afraid. It will come. Um, I'm an apple or apple spice or multi berry tea person, but I also love a good green tea. Elderberry is really good for you too. Um, I enjoy those as well, fair. I'm a bit boring then with my <laughs> with my PG tips. To be fair, chai tea as well. I love a chai tea or chai latte. I have my chai spice outside this door at the minute, which I like to have. But other than that, I just don't don't experiment with tea. Um. Okay, pink hair. Pink hair for banana. I mean, that's interesting. That's kind of teenager -y. Does she have eyes? No. Okay, let's find her some pink eyes. Wait, where are my eyes? Is it makeup? Oh, here. What's everybody doing for the week? Or what are your weekend plans, if you know? Loza, thank you for that follow as well there. Loza Lo, welcome in. Happy Tuesday. Oh, I need to... Did I put that on all the outfits? I think I did. Um, I once tried a blueberry cupcake tea. And it was the first tea that I liked drinking with a splash of milk. Okay. I used to have blueberries like in my fruit bowl. I don't, I don't have fruit bowls at the minute, but um, I think I might be allergic to blueberries. Um, because every time I was eating them, they were giving me a sore tummy. So I think I could have an allergy. Since she came in in this top, I'm inclined to keep her in it. Um, so yeah, I, I have no idea why or how or where where the allergy came from, but um, I just found that any time I was having them. <laughs> It was giving me a sore tummy, so not great, really. Um, hi, Lotta. Welcome in. How are you? You're working all weekend, Mac? That's annoying. Um, tried pomegranate tea. Yeah, I mean, I was just saying, I'm not really a fruit tea drinker. I, I quite like just a classic PG tips, bit of sugar, bit of milk. Bish bash bosh, to be fair. Um, 
Um, I work a close on Friday, so if I'm awake early enough, I might be here for the cleaning stream. Nice, Dragon. I, I mean, it's not going to be anything. <laughs> I feel like I don't want to, like, hype this stream up. Because um, all it is, is literally just going to be me cleaning the house, basically. As a way to encourage me to stream. But then also, if there's, like, house things that you lot need to do. Um, like, or anything sort of work related or productive i guess um then it's also like a stream for you lot to be able to do that and get those things done alongside me i suppose um but yeah don't expect anything too much but it is literally just gonna be me cleaning the house and you lot watching me clean i guess or cleaning along with me that's the plan okay Oh, nice, Sarah. We're actually, I decided yesterday that we're going back to my parents to see my mum and dad and Millie, obviously, on Saturday. Um, because I was literally chatting to mum uh, yesterday and I was like, like, when can we next see you? Like, you'll have to come here and stay and blah, blah, blah. And we realised, like, I've got... Yeah. Some, that looks like she's naked. I've got loads of busy weekends and then they've got uh, a weekend that I could do, but they can't. Um, so I said, well, we can do this Saturday and just come for the day. So on Saturday coming up, we're going to go back to mum and dad. So that should be quite nice. Um, and then on Sunday, we're going away for the night. We're going to the Cotswolds um, for a night. Um, so, yeah. Oh, I didn't mean to. What have I just done? Okay. Um, shenanigans! Thank you for the 15 month resub. Can we please get some hypes in chat for shenanigans there? Thank you for supporting with your resub for 15 whole months. Um, thank you for just being a part of the community, let alone subbing for the last 15 months. Sending big, big love to you there, shenanigans. Thank you for that. I hope you've enjoyed the 15 months. I'm glad you're good, Lozam. Why is banana slaying? <laughs> oh dear. Banana's like feeling the pink vibes. Huh? That is banana as a teenager. CC makeover done. Let's get out of here. Save our eyes. Um, it's very blinding. Um, you'll be folding laundry. Fair enough. Um, depending on yeah, depending on if I can get a wash done this week. Um, I might have laundry to do as well. But I do just, in general, need to clean the house. Like, I need to wipe surfaces. I need to hoover. So it's going to be um, a different stream. <laughs> a very different stream on Friday. But hopefully you lot enjoy it. Right, I'm going to get her to serve some dinner. Actually, she should... Oh, it's 4.29. Serve dinner and then uh, do your homework. Huh. Amelia's taking a nap at the moment. How are these toddlers doing in terms of their skills? Um, let me delete the notifications. Hold on, is she pregnant? No, she's not. No. Right, we need to get her pregnant. That's what we need to be doing. Sorry, I forgot about that. Who was the last baby donor? Brick building. So Brick is an ananas's dad, right? Okay, let's, um, let me just, uh, let's go to Manage Worlds. Let's have a look at the Tazkabaz Townies hashtag and we're going to decide on the next baby donor. I sat on the couch and Nessie just jumped up uh, and laid down behind you before I could sit back. <laughs> You're not allowed to sit in the space now. That's Nessie's face. Uh, hashtag Tazkabaz Townies. Okay. Um, ooh. We have got some cute symptom. Crispy bake. <laughs> you lot are wilding with some of these names. Um, let's see. There are loads of symptom. Ooh, macaron. She's cute. I like her. Um, oh my god, I'm not going with this one. <laughs> ah, 
For goodness sake. I've already had a mystery sim. I don't want another. Let's go with... Uh, oh, Florence is cute. We'll come back for them. Let's go with Macaron. Um, she can go in with the baby donors. I just want to double check. Um, bear with me. I want to go in and check her full name. And I also want to check if she can get others pregnant. Oh, the torque. <sighs> brick building is literally built like a brick building. Okay, Jamie Sun. Oh, she's cute. Okay, she's cute. So she's her name is um Jamie Sun. Jamie Sun. Just so um when um Sim Scheme is back, they know that, uh, what the name is, kind of thing for the document. Um, can she get others pregnant? That's your sim! She's well cute, Nim. So she's a cute sim. How do you check if they can make others pregnant? Oh here. This sim will be able to get others pregnant. Perfect. Okay, cool. Let's go ahead and um, jump into the game and let's get Amelia meeting Jamie. Remind me to get a selfie. Welcome in, entertainment fan. And boy, mama, good morning. How are your Tuesdays going? Yeah, she can make other sims pregnant, so that's good. That's good that we checked him. We'll jump in now and um, get her pregnant. Uh... Okay, let's nip over to um, Jamie and we'll invite her back to the house, I think, just so we can have the toddlers working on their things. And she's originally a sweet berry sim, but I made her vanilla just for this challenge. Oh, cute names. Oh, that's really cute. She's lovely. I like what you've done with her. I have no idea, you know. Um, hang on, let me oh. knock on the door. I'll check the family tree in a minute. I don't know if she has any grandchildren at the moment. Okay. Okay, there she is. We're going to go and do a romantic introduction. Hopefully this works. Got the kiddos off to school, but other than that, good, good. Um, oh, did she like it? Okay, we're getting off to a cracking start. <laughs> Let's crack on with the romance. Let's do some flirts. Um, right, I need to write down. Sorry, I don't know why the thought just came to mind, but tomorrow I want to try and. Um, check the Reaper rewards. And if I can get that working, record a video of that. And I also want to do the occult legacy. Um, no. I hate picking up the phone, especially when it's an unknown number. Occult legacy. I want to do an episode at least for that. And then I need to edit Sims in Bloom. Sorry. The thought just came to mind. I was like, I need to do an occult legacy challenge. I have no idea what um what sparked the thought. But I need to get back to doing that. <laughs> she was one of the sisters of the air for your macaron challenge. Oh cool. Oh, is that why she was called Macaron? Occult Legacy, yeah. I, I really enjoy my occult legacy. I think I, I'm excited for the future gens. Because I've done um I've left a voicemail. Because I've done the Strangerville story before, I'm excited to move on to the next gens with it. Ooh, nice Corvus, you just became a plant sim. Yeah, I'm looking forward to those. And, I, and I've also said that I'd quite like to... Um, can I? Oh, okay. Yeah, I'd quite like to get the enhanced plant sim mod as well when we get to that. Okay, she's proving harder to impress than... What's beeping? Um, I'm going to add her to the contact list. And chat with her through here. One of your co-workers enjoys pranking the spam caller callers to get them to hang up on them. I think it's a... Um, 
company that I contacted about like Nelly doing daycare there. But then I found out like, cause I was just thinking like maybe like one or two days a week. Um, cause the place we do take her to is a bit far away. Um, and also they don't do like pick up or drop off. But the place that uh, I contacted, they now keep calling. <laughs> like they don't stop calling. Um, let's add her to the group and take her back to ours. Um, so yeah, I don't know. Uh, right, back to ours. Um, came up with a world legacy challenge because there's so many worlds now and several I've never even played in. So this way I get a taste of all of them. Um, I got distracted by doing a 100 baby challenge thanks to you. Oh, sorry, shenanigans. Oh, we don't have the number. Sorry, forgot about that. Okay, let's take Jamie up to the bedroom. Oh, there is somebody in my bedroom. <laughs> there is a teenager in my bedroom. Uh, let's kiss her and then we will take her to the bedroom. First kiss. Just got back and my cat was sat there looking at me innocently with food around his mouth. Wait, is he eating food he's not supposed to? Yes, so this is the next donor. Um, her name is, thank you, Sim Scheme. Her name is Jamie Sun. I'll pop it in chat just so you've got it uh, for reference. Thank you. We are about to do the woohoos now. Okay, they're having the first kiss. So, we're going to try for a baby with Jamie. And while you two are trying for the bubble of Roo, let's have a little look at what we can do with these toddlers. So communication, movement, potty and thinking. Can we turn this on? Let's play uh, kids music. Kids radio. And then we'll get the kiddos to come here and Bob. Is it playing? Oh, here. Yeah, Bob to the music. Get that movement skill up. Um, it's election time in the USA, and so my unknown are all political calls. No, thank you. Now moved on to text messages. Yeah, it's good that you can block them. It's annoying, isn't it? Because, like, I hate answering the phone anyway, but when it's an unknown number, it's, like, even worse. Right, are we doing woohoos? Oh, we are. Lovely. We're climbing up the stairs together. <laughs> it always looks so funny when two people climb up. Karen, welcome in. She is 20 days until she's a young adult. But I am going to um, get aged down potions and stuff because I'm enjoying having Amelia at the minute um, as the heir. Or as the matriarch. Um, what? Why did she use a condom? <laughs> Girly pops, no. No, we don't want that. Why did she... <laughs> She is protection. Well, that's not good. How do we tell her no that we don't want her using protection? Um, <laughs> um you can name a baby with channel points. Um, literally have no idea where he got it. He's not the brightest bulb. Uh, oh, bless him. I think Jamie's human. I think so. Um, how do I get her to not use protection? Um, I block every unknown call and text that I get. So it's, if it's ever some actual person, they should have let me know ahead of time. That's fair. Unknown calls are scary. Very kind of you, but not what we want. Exactly. Okay, girly pops. Um, do, do you mind just not doing that? How do I tell her no? How do you say, no, I don't want you to wear protection. <laughs> Where's the option? Wonderful whims. Where does it come up? Um, wonderful. Ask to stop using birth control. That's it. Girly Pops, I don't want you to use birth control, you know? I, I want a child with you. Do you mind not using birth control? Okay, she'll no longer use protection. 
when having woohoo wonderful well done jamie thank you for that wait amelia will no longer use protection wait what do you mean shobi why why is she yadabooing what do you mean sinike get in the shower or somewhere and woohoo no 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 what's going on what Shan, you? thank you for subscribing for your second month. Time, I'm really enjoying the stream, so I had to continue it. Ah, thank you, Shan. Thank you for the support for two months. I really, really appreciate it. And I'm so glad that you're enjoying the streams as well. Thank you for continuing that sub um, for two months now. Can we get some loves um, in chat, you lot, for Shan there? Thank you for that, darling. Thank you so much. Um... If it's wonderful, you need to do it that way. So she's not going to use protection now, but then why are we now not able to do any woohoo? I don't get it. Can we do it now? Cry for baby. Oh, I forgot we had a newborn child. We can do super efficient care for that child. I just need to know what's going on here. Oh, we're going back up. Wait, come back down. Ah! Oh, she's glitched out. Okay, hold on. Just... Ah! Just come here for now. She's going up and down the stairs like a blooming yo-yo. Right, where are you off to? Are we woohooing or are we not? Romance? Physical intimacy. Try for baby in the shower. Let's just do it in the shower. Oh, you reckon there's not enough space to actually initiate it? Kate, thank you for the five stream watch streak. Okay, let's try. Oh, we're steamy. Love that. Very steamy. Right, they're gonna go and do the woohoos. You're bobbing away to the music on level two. That's good. Keep bobbing. You also should be bobbing to the music as well. Um, getting that skill up. She's doing her homework, so that's fine. We're getting there. Might be worth turning off auto protection use. Otherwise, most sims will do it. How do you turn off auto protection? I feel like this is reset since I re-downloaded Wonderful Whims. Woohoo settings. No. Pregnancy settings. Relationship settings. Body setting? Pregnancy setting? Birth control? Oh. Um. Oh, that one. Condom automatic use, pills automatic use. There we go. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. That's better. She's sick. Hey, what do you mean she's sick? Who's sick? She be Chavina. Who's sick? Oh, sleepy. Right, we're going to woohoo in the shower. Who Who's sick? I think that's just her pyjama bottoms, actually. <laughs> I think those are her orange pyjama bottoms. NPC birth control use on the same page. Oh, I'll have a look now in a minute. Hang on. Oh, in we go. All right, hopefully she gets pregnant from that. She is not enjoying the kids' music. Did she do her homework? No. Okay, right, turn this off then. Uh, mute, why don't you watch some TV? Because we need to get you doing your homework. Having a really bad time. Well, that's not great, is it? Right, you can't bob to music anymore. So you can go and work on thinking skill. Actually, just go and play on the iPads. Go and do sim shapes on the iPads. And that gets that skill up. Once her fun goes up a bit, she can do her homework. Yeah, let me double check if we can take off... NPC protection. Right, we've got fireworks. We can take a pregnancy test. So let's see now. Uh, wonderful whims. Settings. 
NPC birth control use. Select to make some of NPC. Let's do unsafe. <laughs> unsafe mode. Nobody is safe in this town. Okay, we need to take a selfie actually as well, providing we're pregnant. We need to then go ahead and take a photo with Jamie to go on the wall. Oh, yes. Okay, she is pregnant. Amazing. Let's go get a selfie and then, yeah, that's our next baby donor. Fab. She went pregnant. Hooray. Are you taking a selfie? Yes. Need to get a picture for the wall. Chimeraja bean slawfish. No quimbo. I don't know if we are. Take a photo. Ah. <laughs> I mean, we have space for triplets. Whether she will, I don't know. We haven't had triplets yet. Uh, what are we doing? We're doing this way round, don't we? Oh. Okay, there we go. Her and Jamie for the wall. Let's go and pop that upstairs and onto our baby donor wall. Go. Right, all these other pictures can be deleted. We've got loads of money now. We've got 4K, which is... Oh, wrong word. I've been thinking about this a lot and wanted to ask if you'd like to live together. Babes, we just met today <laughs> and we woohooed and now you want to live together? <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. I'm about to break your heart, but I just don't think it's the right time. I am so sorry, Jamie. You know, I admire your persistence and I admire your loyalty and, and want to live here, but it's just not the right time. <laughs> oh, bless her cotton socks. Um, right, Amelia, can you please go and serve dinner for everybody? Because we don't have much foodies in the house at the minute or in the thing. Right, your mood is much better, so you need to do your homework, then you can use the toilet. Feeling focused, that's good. Kiddos are getting their thinking skill up. They are stink. Little stinky bubble of rose. Um, um I know from experience they suck. Oh yeah, triplets are wild. Even like we in the 100 baby challenge, it's tough because you've got to obviously get all their skills up and everything. But we had triplets in My Sims in Bloom save in Indies Generation. No. Indies Gen? Who had triplets? No, Thorn had triplets. Um, and it was stress. <laughs> so, you know. Um, if you have so many babies, could you buy a few painting stations and earn money by selling them? Oh, yeah. We've got a, a easel here as well. Um, so we do make money by by doing the paintings and then selling them. That's how we've sort of got the 40k. And we've also been making crystals as well. And then selling those. Um, let's go and harvest all of these crystals as well. How can we get this plant up a little bit better? Let's maybe fertilise it with a minnow. Because somebody said that if you get this like tree quality up, um, you get better stems from it. Anything exciting there? I don't think so. Let's research into the plant. Yeah, we probably will have to at one point. I think in the last 100 baby challenge, I think I had a basement of all of the baby donors. Um, okay. Right, she's there doing that. She was going to make foodies. Oh, yeah. Go and finish this. Wait, there's so, there's a few things <laughs> that was going to be done here. What's that? Campus stew. Right. Go make all of these. She is standing there doing nothing. Do extra credit work. Ready for tomorrow. And she needs to get one skill to level three. Uh, let's do charisma because that's quite close. So you can practice your speech after you've done that. This little girly pops is sleepy, so go and sleep. And she's also sleepy. Um, could you do child labour to earn more? Adeli, thank you for that lurk. 
I know I'm having your baby, but I think you're moving too fast. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, she passed out before she made it there. Oh, no. I've been off for today. It's my father-in-law's birthday, so we're going over to visit them. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Taz, my love, and chat. Take care, Mia. I hope your father-in-law has a lovely birthday as well. Um, and thank you for hanging out today. Thank you, thank you. Have a lovely, lovely day. Um, and yeah, we'll see you soon. We will see you soon. Amelia reached garden in level four. That's good. Well done. How'd you get this up then? Talk to the plant. Oh, it's fine. Let's go and do some cooking for now. Yeah. This baby, Ananas, I hate to say it, but this little pineapple loving baby has been the calmest of all the babies. Yeah, we've got the tablet as well. So we use that sometimes too, but we haven't needed to because we've got 40k. So I'm not as fussed about making money. <gasps> Chaos got married and Calamity got married and Girlie got married. Wait! Has Gurley just married her dad? No. Gurley has married Lou. Wasn't Lou a baby donor? Who is Gurley? Ah! What? Gurley and Lou are now married. But Lou, oh, somebody's had a baby. So Shu, Shu and Sock. But why is Lou not there as their donor? So Gurley has married Lou. Oh, uh, wait, in this save, I don't think he's registered as their dad. Because remember, we had to switch saves. <laughs> I, I think it's okay. I think it's okay. I don't think we registered them as his dad. Because remember, we switched save because River bugged out the last save. So I think it's fine. <laughs> Oh my lord, everything, yeah. The last save was broken, so we had to move everybody over to um, a whole new save. Because, like, I couldn't properly save the game. Speaking of which, I am going to do a save. But I couldn't save the game or anything. So, um, yeah, it's just all bugged. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. At least it wasn't her dad. Like, imagine if it was, like, Shoe or Sock that married their own dad. That would have been weird. Uh, Family trees are broken in the game in general. I don't think we said it back. Yeah, I think you're right. I think you're right. Let's resume this stew. And then you can eat that. I know. <laughs> it literally was River. But then in this particular save, we didn't add River in. Um, and it's not caused any issues. Oh, we need to rent in. Brick building. Uh, we need to name this Jamie Sun. There we go. For the paintings, uh, the photos named. Banana's doing her extra credit work and then is going to get that charisma up before bed. God, the house seems so empty now. Everybody's gone and it's all empty. It is still a tiny home as well. Yeah, all River is nowadays is a black hole. I can't. Oh, she's reached charisma. That's good. I actually cannot believe that um, we've started sev Gen Seven in Sims in Bloom. Like we're seven generations in now. It's gone so fast. I feel. Right, that's done. That's good. Pop that there. Did you sort the child out? Are you actually having a giggle? Yeah. Thanks so oh, much. Hey. Oh, I'm glad I can make you laugh. That's good. Thank you very much for the 100 bits there. I really, really appreciate it. Um, thank you for that lovely message. All the animals have been cared for, so now I can actually sit and watch the stream. Oh, no, we didn't do that, actually, Coley. Did we even do that for brick building? 
I also need to like remove their relationships. Uh, brick building, baby donor seven. Jamie is baby donor eight. Baby donor eight. Thank you for reminding me. Oh wait, let's do the house one because she wanted to move in. <laughs> no, babe, sorry, you're not moving in. Hi, Danny. Welcome in. Welcome, welcome. Okay, go use the toilet, have a nice shower, and then head to bed. I feel like she's going to pass out before she showers. I'm just going to do that. Wait, what are you doing? Wait, don't wash your hands. Why are you washing your hands? There's literally, if you want to wash your hands, there's a sink there. This is a bathroom. This is a kitchen. Kitchen. Set sink type. Bathroom. 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 Okay. Hopefully. <laughs> Go back. Go and have a shower. Silly sausage. Why are you standing there like an idiot? Okay, we're showering. My husband always asks why I yell at my game all the time. I said, because these sims don't ever listen. Literally. Think about Jamie. Okay. She's liking Jamie. Uh, happy October, Danny. Welcome on in. And Clouda, welcome in. Um, I don't know. It's normally like until I need to go and sort my puppy out. <laughs> but welcome on in. Welcome, welcome. How are you doing today? And happy October to you as well. Um, and Fumatina, thank you for that follow. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the community. What's this feeling? Steamy daydream. Having a steamy relationship means that Amelia's daydreams are sometimes a little bit warm. <gasps> okay. And in the shower as well. <laughs> okay. Oh, these kids are cold because they're sleeping out in winter. <laughs> it's giving Tristan vibes. We need to go back to Nightmare Legacy at some point. Um, A true soulmate. Good morning, Peanut. Welcome in. I've watched a video, someone's 100 baby challenge on YouTube that I came across and they were giving keys to everyone who they had a baby with so they could come and go as they please. That sounds chaotic, dragon. <laughs> Just like all of them coming in and out and then probably not even helping with the baby, that, that, like their child. That sounds chaotic. Tina, welcome in. How are you doing today? If you have a small vacuum in your inventory, you can use it to clean kids. Toddlers for sure. Might be helpful when you don't feel like bathing them. Oh, that's a good idea. Let's get a vacuum. I forgot that. To be fair, when they brought out the, um, like the, what pack did it come in again? I can't remember, but the kit, dust busters or whatever. I, I was like, ooh, nice. And then I don't think I ever used it again after that. So um, yeah, I completely forgot that was a thing. Let's pop that in our inventory. Cute idea. Um, you love October because of Halloween and it's your daughter's birth month. Oh, happy second birthday to her. Have you got a little birthday party planned then? That's super cute. Might come and go if they clean and cook, true. Yes, I do know you can wash them in the sink. I do know about that little hack. Right, are you going to go and eat? Or are you just going to stand there? Welcome back, Adeli. Hello. Um, my day's been good, thank you. I had a... Right, we're sending her to school. Had a pretty chilled morning. Tried to do a little bit of editing. Um, and then, yeah, we've just been playing some of our 100 Baby Challenge. Right, let's go sort the child out. And then go get some foodies yourself. Marriage isn't um, as bad as the sim being a caregiver to someone not related. Then having the option to romance them. What? Last night my sim flirted with his stepmother because he's attracted to her. And the attraction is mutual. I quickly moved him out. Oh god, that's awful. Oh dear. Bust the dust, that's the name of it. Have it at local park with friends and family. That's really nice. Oh, I hope she has a lovely second birthday. One who was helping out with everything and one would just come and stand around watching. Yeah. Those are the two most notable. Oh, I'm glad you like the toddlers. 
They're very stinky at the moment. Um, but yeah, <laughs> this is Whoopsie and Evangeline. Um, little stinky babies, but cute heads. Your daughter's turning 12. Teenage behaviour coming in, that's it. Oh, I hope she has an amazing 12th birthday. Oh, she can't reach the mailbox. I have no idea why. Picky eater. Right, we need to really work on whoopsie and doopsie skills today. Right, I'm going to get her to hose them down. <laughs> How do you do that, toddler care? I've got the thingamajig in my inventory. Clean toddler with vacuum. Okay, this is brilliant. Let's do this. Does it fully clean them as well? What a great idea. They aged up in the last episode. Um, the episode that's going on YouTube tonight, actually. Right. Are we vacuuming them? Here we go. <laughs> Yay! Little stink monster. Does it actually clean them? Yay! Okay, she's clean. Oh, it did nothing. <laughs> it barely did anything. Oh, no. Okay, can we... Wait, vacuum the sink? Why can you vacuum the sink? Right, we're going to clean up Whoopsie and Evangeline. Clean up, clean up in the sink. Because that didn't do anything. That was... Oh, my lordy, she's farting and all. That was um, vacuuming her with what can't be vacuumed. Amelia can't help but congratulate herself on finding a new way to clean her toddler. They may throw a tantrum when it's bath time, but they find the whirring sounds and pull of the vacuum cleaner to be rather entertaining. It didn't do much to, to clean in her, uh, to be honest. But let's try... Um, the sink does a better job, I think, doesn't it? Let's do some sink ones. Oh. Yeah, that's much better. Um, and we need to be working on their skills. This is so difficult. Okay, movement is like up to two. <sighs> Let's get Amelia helping them, I think. This is hard. Right, she she needs a diaper change, I think, because she is still stinky. Change her diaper. All right, you're done. You need attention. Um, I, <laughs> there were a couple of people on the last episode saying, don't worry about people saying about, um, like using plum by it. But then some people on previous episodes were like, oh, it's too easy using the plum by it. Now I'm just like, I don't know. <laughs> I, oh, wait, we're hoovering the, the sink. Can we hoover everything in this house? It's wild. Um, now I'm like, I don't know. Maybe it's good to have a bit of a challenge. Right, stop hoovering the sink. It's ridiculous. No dust left behind. She's on a vacuuming kick. She's found a vacuum and is now doing everything. Like hoovering everything with the vacuum. <laughs> the handheld hoover. She's loving it as well. Um, yeah, I'm like... Oh, we're feeling sick now. It does help a lot, but also I'm like, I'll do, maybe I'll do episodes where at times I make it easier for myself and use the plum bite and some where I make it harder and don't use the plum bite. We'll do a mishmash. Um, okay, right. We need to sort out some skills here. So let's do some flashcards, I think. Help with, uh, wait, where is it? Activities? Yeah, teach to talk. Um, oh my god, are you stinky now as well? Oh, she just threw up! Did she just throw up on her child? That is gross! Oh god. You do, yeah, thank you. Thank you, everyone. Why is she just holding a child? Put it down and teach them to talk. What are you doing? You big Egypt. Why are you standing there like a lemon? 
I told you to teach the child to talk. But you're not doing any of that. Do flashcards. Um, you can't do flashcards. Do that. Right, whoopsie reached movement level three. Great. Evangeline, you can work on your communication skill. Good morning, Ari. Happy October over to California. Welcome in. Whoopsie reached communication level two. All right, we've got a diaper. Um, and little, is this Evangeline? No, Whoopsie. Yeah, no. Whoopsie is like partially deaf in one ear as well. So I like to think that Amelia would probably, while teaching her to talk, like would be teaching her sign language. Um, I think that's sweet. Banana is like in a bad mood at school today. Oh gosh. Maybe we do need to get the plum bite. <laughs> Maybe we need to bring the plum bite back for a little bit. Um... Pop it on the shelf. Just for a little while. Okay, we're learning to talk. Oh, that's cute. Right, do some more toddler videos. I think let's... Oh, she reached level two. Let's just talk at them. I feel like that will even help just chatting to them oh she needs to wee why did you remove like oh, why did it remove everything that I queued up small talk talk about day banana just doesn't want to leave exactly hi Cripply welcome in how are you my love how's your week going Right, just talk at them. And that might help with their communication. Um, Makawaka, Makawaka, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Um, and Silver Moon, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome on in, Silver and Raiders. Hear the howls in the distance. It's a wolf raid. Welcome in. I hope that you had... A lovely stream thank you so much for choosing me to raid today um welcome welcome my name is taz i use she her pronouns and we are currently playing um the sims for my 100 baby challenge um it's good to see you silver how was your stream welcome in today welcome in makawaka as well there um i have soup to fend off the cold weather what flavor soup have you got crippling seen you sending off peach and decided to have bad grades yeah she literally doesn't want to leave um thank you so so much though for that raid if you do need to raid and run obviously please go do what you gotta do um but thank you so much for popping on in it's good to have you here uh remember when the sims 4 was marketed as having smarter sims really i mean they're not listening yeah they barely listen to things that you, you tell them but Oh, she's feeling protective of her kids. Cute. Ooh, Japanese style with prawn dumpling. Nice. Uh, gonna switch games and sim in along with you. Nice, Silver. Did you do sims on stream or you did something else? Oh, whoopsies just learned how to talk. Amazing. Right, you now need to work on thinking. And then it's just potty. So let's have her doing the thinking skill. What about Evangeline? She's getting that communication up. And then we'll need to do movement. Oh, you were doing Genshin on stream. Fair. Oh, child, baby newborn is crying. Let's do super efficient newborn care. That sorts it all out. Oh, banana's an A. Banana got an A in school. Which means we can age her up into an adult, a young adult, and move her out of the house. Amazing. Okay, Banana's aging up. Here we go. She's blowing out the candles and she is aging up into a young adult, getting an A in school. Evangeline just reached level three communication. Good for you. You can now go ahead and work on movement skill. Well done. Yay. Oh, better exceptions. 
Yay! Okay, Banana has aged up and her final trait is active. So Banana has the traits practice makes perfect, paranoid, and finally active. Why don't we give her athletic? Maybe she wants to be a bodybuilder. So Banana's aspiration is bodybuilder and her third trait is active. Amazing. Yay! Okay, she's all aged up. And now we can go ahead and move her on out. I'm just going to get her to put birthday candles on the cake. So I can put that back in the fridge. Put the birthday candles on. And then we can move her out. Cool. All right, let's do a save. And then let's say goodbye to Banana. And uh, that opens up four slots now in the house. I don't think I have quads on. I don't think. I don't know, but I don't think. Maybe I do. I'm not sure, to be honest. <laughs> I haven't. Um, let's move her. Right, where's an active world? Maybe we'll move her into... There's, like, Copperdale. I don't know. No, let's move her to uh, San Sequoia. Because there's a nice, like, lake there. And I'm sure she'd love running around the lake. Right, bye, banana. Have a nice life. See you never. Oh, she's moving in with the girl from Copperdale, I think. Or university? I don't know. Oh, I need to sneeze. Yes, I do. I'll check the setting. Is it empty? Do you have to check it through there, then? I can have a look. Oh, God. Having quads now would be pure chaotic. Did we have quads in the first 100 Baby Challenge? Oh, Lumpy New has updated Core Library. Oh, I need to remember to do that later. Oh, I don't have it in the game at the minute. <laughs> Sorry, no, I removed RPO, uh, Relationship Pregnancy Overhaul. Because it was causing every time I would click on another sim. Like, for example, I'm on Amelia now. Every time I'd click on another sim this like uh, option menu would take like a good five to 10 seconds to load. So I don't have that anymore. Um, MCC, and I think it is pregnancy. And then it's Are Max Offspring. Ooh, let me have a look. Have found a way to enjoy doing this challenge again. Ah, oh, thank you, Dragon. It's nice that you are doing it in a way that keeps it fun for you. So you don't stress yourself out with it. Thank you. Thank you for saying that, Dragon. And thank you so much for the 100 bit set as well. That is super generous. Thank you for supporting me in that way as well. And just for your lovely, lovely message. Um, I really appreciate it. Can we get some loves in chat for Dragon, you lot? Thank you, darling. Um, MC Pregnancy, Offspring. Max Offspring, three. Yeah, we have Plum Bite as a fullback. Do I set it to four? Or am I just making it harder? <gasps> no, I am I'm not doing the max of six. It's either four or nothing. Well, four or three. Unlurk. Chris literally just unlurked to say yes. Fine. It's set to four. I swear to God, if this pregnancy that she's having now turns into four kids, I am blaming you lot. <laughs> just putting that out there. You lot are getting the blame for that one if, if it happens to be four. If we do have four, then the plum bite is coming back. I'm telling you that for free. Right, you kids need to sort your needs out, I think. Oh, she's fine. Evangeline. I don't know how she suddenly has all needs. Um, okay, you can go and get some foodies. Um, oh, I'll tell you why, because I put the plum bite back in. <laughs> Let's go in this room. Let's go play in this room, actually. That'll be good. Go here. Let's all go here. And Amelia can come in and do some skills with them. Uh, you can get through the challenge faster. This is true. I'm on a mission to get through this challenge like faster this time than I did for the first 100 baby. Like I want it to go quicker. 
Um, okay, I'm going to get her to... What skill does she need, sorry? Movement and thinking. Right, Amelia, Wait, can you do some thinking? Take the Dragon! You'll take the blame. Thank you for the 145 bits. Um, I appreciate it. Thank you so much. It wouldn't be a Taz dream without chaos, I suppose. Um, thank you for that, though. I missed a stream where you redid the house. Love the tiles in the kitchen slash dining room. Thank you, Adele. Um, thank you again for those bits, my love. Um, and Caitlin, hello, welcome on in. Welcome, welcome. Um, can't blame me, I said nothing. Or do I get blamed because the donor's my sim? Yeah, you get partial blame, Nims. No, I'm not setting the baby to six. I am going to go and do a quick wee, though. Sorry. I'll be back in a sec. I'm back. Um, we want curse, but we don't want to end up Taz to end up losing all of her hair. <laughs> yeah, six would be way too much. I will compromise and we'll do four. That's the deal. Deal or no deal. Oh god, all six crying. Like all newborns. Oh god. Worst nightmare ever. Right, come here, child. What are you doing? Right. She's working on her thinking. Come on, keep going. Let's get that thinking skill up. She's just reached thinking level two. So we're going to do it again. Grace, leave me alone. I'm trying to get my child's thinking skill up. This child, you can go and... Can she just watch? Just watch. Watch them. She only needs to work on potty, but she needs help. Well, no, she needs to work on thinking and potty. But actually, watching her sister and watching her mum is getting getting this up. So keep watching. She may get hers up just by watching them. Ah, ah, come back and watch. Uh friendly watch and we're gonna watch keep watching watch 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 yes okay she got hers up literally by watching is there anything that amelia can do with her for movement Okay, her thinking's up. So we just need to get her movement up. I know she can dance if there's music, right? Like they can dance to the music. Um, but is there anything else? Can she like teach her to walk? Maybe not. 
Why don't we get her potty training them both? Potty train Evangeline. Just get them to wander or run away. Oh, okay. I just make them walk all over the place. Okay, we can do that. I didn't know if there was anything that Amelia could do to help with that. But what? Oh, an ananas aged up into an infant. Oh, she's cautious. Oh, I thought she was angry. These sims appreciate the familiar, but are slow to warm up to new experiences, locations, and sims. Okay, Ananas has just aged up into a infant. I have a feeling these two will be able to age up soon. So I'm kind of a bit reluctant to go into do a CC makeover until these two are done. Let's put um, put Whoopsie on the toilet and potty train Whoopsie. Okay. Right. Is she potty training? Okay, she's potty training. You need to... Let's just get you running around. Go here. Just walk around. <laughs> walk around the entire house, back and forth. Hold on, was that not potty tra Potty train her? Whoopsie. Teach them to dance or help them build. Oh, that's true. The building. Wait, is she not helping her? I thought she was meant to be helping Potty Trainer. I'm confused. Okay, you just keep going. You run around a bit more. We're nearly there. Keep going. That movement is, is going to go up eventually. Go here. She's just running back and forward. Go here. Watch an ananas. Go and watch an ananas. And then come back. They can dance, to be fair. Oh, whoopsie acquired the body skill. Okay. But it's not at level two yet. So we need to wait until it's at level two before uh, we can go, like, have her going on her own. Yeah, they can dance together. But I'm trying to get her, like, get Amelia working with whoopsie on potty training. A potty training isn't something that they can do on their own. Whereas the movement is, I guess, with them running back and forward. So I thought while she's working on that... There we go. Evangeline has already reached movement level three. Oh, yeah, she could have done the slide, couldn't she? Oh, well, thank you. <laughs> We've done it now, so that's good. Now it's literally potty as well. So I'm actually going to get her to go and watch her sister on the potty. This little bubba's crying because it because uh, an ananas needs food. Oh, hold on. If we can just get them both up to level two. Oh, she can use it on her own. Wait, she can do it on her own. So why are we? All right, hold on. All right, you keep going potty. Working on that skill. You don't need to be helping her anymore because she can do it on her own now. So get Evangeline on the potty. Because Evangeline can't do it on her own. So we're going to help her until she can do it on her own. And then we'll leave them to it. And then Amelia can go and sort out Pineapple's needs. Right, you're just going to keep going potty. Potty buddies, that's it. Right, we need help. One more time, probably. Right, she can now use it on her own. So I'm going to get Amelia now to go and sort out this little madam. So no sleeping. You're now going to go and be fed. Go and feed her. And Ananas loves wake-up time. And frequently sneezes. Um, yeah, you go sort an ananas out. You are going to go potty on your own and get it up to level three. And then we can age them up into kiddos. And it's just this little madam. Right. You're being fed. And then I'm going to get her to put an ananas down here. And we can start working on the infant needs. And we're getting somewhere with this. Ah, oh, they just became good friends, Amelia and Pineapple. Cute. Oh, they were all doing so well. 
Okay, keep going. I'm drinking so so much water. I forgot to ask Alex actually how big this thing is. I just got distracted with him saying he Oh whoops he reached level three! Yeah, I got distracted with him saying how proud he was of me for drinking all this water. I forgot to actually ask him how much. Um how big that like water thing is. Right, so whoopsie reached level three, so she's now ready to be aged up. Um, so let's bring her out here. She can now be aged up, but we'll wait until Evangeline's reached it too, and then age them up together. Amelia is in her second, second trimester, third in 20 hours. Oh, is it? About one and a half litres. That's good. You've got the same, a similar one, yeah. I'll ask Alex. How much do they say you should drink of water a day? Like, what's the recommended amount? Is there a recommended amount? Okay, hold on. Go do tummy time. Oh, two litres is what's recommended. Okay. That's what I, I've not I've not done that for as long as I've lived. But now I'm actually getting to the point where that might be possible. Right, and Ananas has just lifted her head. Amazing progress. Let's do some more tummy time. What are you doing? Go do tummy time. Evangeline's looking very close to level three. I just don't think my body's used to having water in it. My dad doesn't drink a lot of water either. Okay, she needs to do one more. Okay. Hoping for a boy and girl since I have enough for two. Um, so I, I only allow people to name one, um, one baby during the stream, just so it gives people, other people a chance to name them. Um, otherwise, like, like, you know, there's only a hundred babies and I want for everybody to be able to name them. Um, and like, ideally not the same people each time. Um, otherwise it's not really fair. Right, Evangeline has mastered potty training. So... That means we can now age them up into children. So let's go ahead and help blow out the candles for Whoopsie and then Evangeline. Yeah. Okay, let's go ahead and age them up. Right, Whoopsie is aging up first. We'll go and add the birthday candles. Oh my god, Evangeline, get out of the toilet! Get out of the toilet and come and age up into a child. Right, help Evangeline blow out the candles. Oh god, we're off on a mission to age up. I don't know where she's going. Perfect. Okay, whoopsie's first trait is child of the islands. Okay, I'm just going to give her, I think, the social skill. The social butterfly aspiration. But her first trait um, is child of the islands. So cute. Probably because she spent so much time on the toilet and the water. <laughs> now Evangeline is going to age up. Um... Oh, that's a sweet idea, Caesar. Okay. Thing is, you've got to be quick to redeem it. People are very, very speedy. Oh, that's gone off. Oh, we'll clean that up. Right, Evangeline's first trait is gloomy. Oh, bless her. Okay, Evangeline is gloomy. Let's give her this sim wants to be playful and nimble. She can have a rambunctious scamp as her aspiration as a child, but gloomy is Evangeline's first trait. Oh, bless her. Okay. Let's go ahead, nip into Cass. We've got three CC makeovers to do here now. So, Whoopsie and Evangeline's baby donor was... Who was their baby donor? 
So, um, Ananas's was brick building. I remember that. But who was Whoopsie and uh, Whoopsie and Dipsy? <laughs> Whoopsie and Evangelines? I have no idea. Okay. If you maybe two front teeth. Oh, that's precious. That's cute. Do that. That's so cute. The little wispy baby hair bits at the front. Um. Okay. She's got like um a dark brown eye. Let's do that one. Um. She's got eyelashes. Oh, eyebrows. We have a lovely shower, Caesar, and thank you for hanging out with us today. All I remember is he had a bag head. What was his name? Hold on, let me do. This is why we've got the Google Doc. Uh, what was his name? Oh, Elijah. Oh, yeah. He had, did he have brown hair? Am I right in saying that? Thank you. Uh, the eyes on each outfit. Because I like to give them the same sort of hair as their baby donor. Wait, why is that? What's glitching there? Glitching. Oh, we don't need the pictures to be fair, because we've got the picture wall. We can see them. Um, we can see them there and match them to the to the name. The Google Doc is more sort of just to keep track of names and traits and who's who and whatnot. I think that's um, pictures for Dad a bit bit very complex. Oh, the dummy on the lashes. But that's strange because the lashes are on the skin detail. Which normally it's all fine. Oh well. Brown hair, he was like a farmer boy, cottage living vibes. Yeah, I think I, he was quite good looking, wasn't he? I cut my um, hand this morning. I forgot to tell you. Well, actually not this morning. When I was chopping the panini um, for lunch, I um, ac accidentally caught my hand. It didn't actually bleed. Although it looks like there's a small bit of blood. It didn't, I don't, I think it was like a surface cut. Because it didn't bleed, but it is quite sore. Oh. That's so annoying. I wanted her to have a little dummy. Glitches for you with rings. Yeah, it normally does it with rings. But I don't know why it would glitch with this little baby. That's cute, the little purple one. I like that top. You can keep that and then do some little shorts. Um, hot weather wear. You can be a little bee. Sweet. Cold weather. Cute little fox top. We'll do a little elephant. Again, we're not going to see any of these outfits really. But that is a little Ananas um, brick buildings. Brick building? Brick building's daughter. Let's go and put some CC onto Child, Whoopsie, and Evangeline. Oh, they're so short. Um, I've got the gradual height slider mod. Um, so they start off really small and then they gradually increase in height. So right now they're all pretty tiny, which makes it harder in Cass actually to figure out. Uh, or to do CC, because they're so small. They are cute, aren't they? Robo, welcome in. How are you doing today? Thank you for popping on in. No, you haven't missed stream. We're just actually... Um, Whoopsie and Evangeline have just aged up. So we're currently adding their CC to them. 
lashes in the makeup category will still glitch. Oh, because it's the same slot. Yeah. Annoying, isn't it? Um, okay. Give you brown hair. Nice one. And then eyes. I like a hazily green. Hazily brownie green. My ashes. I actually can't tell what they They're fine, let's do them. Okay. Your morning's been relaxing. Took a much needed nap with your baby. Oh, a three. That's nice that you've had a relaxing morning. Cute. Let's go dungarees. I like the green. Um, I feel like I need a hot chocolate. I've got these, um, I got us these pumpkin mugs from Matalan. I can't remember. I got a load of like Halloween-y, no, not Halloween-y, more like autumnal -y things for the house. And these pumpkin mugs were one of those things. I think they're Matalan. Um, but we're yet to like christen them. We're yet to have a um, drink in them. But we were saying at the weekend, like, oh, we need to have like, a hot chocolate in the mugs. We just haven't done it yet, so I might suggest it to Alex tonight. It's that kind of weather. She had one baby. Uh, she had an ananas in the last episode. Speaking of an ananas, pineapple. <laughs> um, yeah, she had one baby in the last episode. She is currently pregnant at the moment, um, but we don't know how many, obviously. Um, She's pregnant with at the minute. You've been living off of hot chocolate this week? Yeah. It's just like hot chocolate on a cold day. There's just something about it, you know? In pajamas. Hello, Chaos Armor. Chaos Armor is having sweet and sour chicken with mashed potato and vegetables on your break. That sounds yummy. That sounds like a nice food to have on your break. Um, Oh, I like this outfit. You, you like autonomously put that on, but you can wear that. Again, we never see these outfits ever, so it's fine. She could be wearing a, a bin bag and it would be fine. Um, hot weather, let's just do a t-shirt. That's cute, that one. Cute, and then cold weather. Do, 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 do. Yeah. You're grey. <laughs> and some jeans. It's the gradual height slider mod, I think. So I was using the Lumia height slider, um, but it stopped working, I think. I don't think it has been updated for a while. Right, that's a little whoopsie CC makeover. Let's go and do Evangeline's. Um, but yeah, so I'm using the gradual height slider mod and it basically gradually, um, like they gradually get taller throughout their childhood and teenhood. Um, rather than like becoming a teenager and then suddenly being the exact same height as like the adults. Um, so yeah. Yeah, that's it, Robo. That's it. I might see if I have any to, uh, to make a hot chocolate. Yes, Nims. Waiting for your Asda delivery fair. I'm not bad, Natsama. Nelly's good. She, um, a bit TMI, but she actually pooed in the garden today after not doing a poo in the garden for ages so that was quite good she did that before stream that was great um and now yeah we've been playing some sims it is actually an ananas <laughs> an ananas look at the bottom left Chasobi specifically um, called the child an ananas because I say an ananas. <laughs> um, thank you, Nims. Yes, Nims has popped the um, link to the mod in chat. Um, so if you do want to get it, thank you, Nims. Um, a nose overlay, a little smile and some hair. That's a cute 
cute hair. I don't think I've used that hair on my Sims. Do that one. Some eyes. That's okay. Yeah, I think it's um I don't specifically know how to actually pronounce the word, the specific um the actual word, but trust Obies did it just because I say it how I say it. He needs eyelashes. Okay. It's a cute hair. Very cute, isn't it? Off on an adventure. <laughs> yeah, go see if you can make a hot chocolate. Right. Uh, I did with the Lumia one where it wasn't sort of working. This one I've only had, I've had it less than a week. Um, so I haven't had bugs at the moment as of yet. Well, let's do red. Have I missed curse? No, you're all good. Other than them, t uh, the, the, this lot saying they wanted uh, quads and me somehow agreeing to it. It's been pretty, pretty good. Yeah, go get a blanket. There is a chill in the air here as well. Like my hands are actually freezing at the moment. I like the difference in all the heights. Yeah. Yeah, so they change their height and they grow like um so when they're at the end of like childhood, they're at the highest of heights, and then they go back to being small when they become a teenager. Uh yes, definitely. Is that even a question? You should definitely have a hot chocolate. Do it. Uh let's do that. Halloween babies. I can't believe we're already in the month of Halloween. Time goes quick. You're feeling the cold too. There is a chill in the air, isn't there? I was saying to Alex yesterday, I was like, it's so cold. Like the air is cold in the house. He was like, I don't feel it. <laughs> this man is like made of like ice. No, made of heat. I'm made of ice. He just doesn't feel the cold. But like I said earlier, he runs hot, whereas I run cold. Okay, that is Evangeline and Whoopsie's CC makeover. Oh, I don't know what I've just done there. They are all done. Perfect. Um, um, It was seven degrees Celsius here this morning. So cold. It feels cold. What's the temperature here at the moment? 12 degrees Celsius. It feels colder, at least in the house it does. Okay. And now it's raining. Can I go get an Ellie Bob's up here for the last part? She's been asleep for nearly three hours. Um, I'll bring her up and see if she's a good girl. I don't I don't think she will be. Let me move a couple. Why is this? Why she'll go for this? that we should be fine right i'll go get nelly and see how we how we do bringing her up up here i don't know what uh, <laughs> what she's gonna be like oh i do know sorry i've got some boxes here wedding happening soon so i've got different boxes we switch to, oh hi. There we go. All right, I'll be back in a sec. <laughs>
See the way that's why I took the toys off of her. I know she's a big girl now. Um, Cad, thank you for those bits, my love. Thank you. Hi, where are you off to, baby girl? Come here. Hi, Nelly. Where are you going, Missy Moops? No, you can't go on the bed. No, you can't go on the bed. And come up. background there oh, wow that was a big yawn i don't know if you look caught that <laughs> did you hear that big yawn that was a big yawn for a little girl Nini. Nini. <laughs> madam Nelly? Nelly? What have you got? Hello, darling! Oh, did you give everyone a big kiss? Did you? Me too, then. Are you actually having a giggle? Bits for a cutie, Nelly Tazkub Squishy Tazkub Love. Oh, I should probably move them on. Look at your bits. Being for everyone to watch. That's that's very ladylike, isn't it? You're a lady. Good girl. I don't know if she'll stay there. Jady, thank you for the 100 bits there as well. Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, her yawns, some of her yawns, not all of them, but some of them are so loud. Like ridiculously loud and... Girl's gotta do what a girl's gotta do. Exactly. You knew. Oh. My. Hey. God. Thank you so much for gifting Janicorn a sub. Thank you for six in total in the channel as well. Um, Janicorn, enjoy your gifted sub from Tay. Thank you for that, my love. Thank you, thank you. Nelly. Nelly. What are you doing? Yeah. Look, come here. Oh, you're so cute. Yeah. Oh. Hail hits everything. She's so big. She looks so big on stream now. Are you actually having a giggle? Woo. Okay. Is this some Nelly stream chaos? Thank you for pizza, oh, you pizza, pizza. Oh dear. No, mummy let just let you kiss her face. Um <laughs> Oh you got hot chocolate. Um Has thank you for those bits as well there. Thank you, thank you. Hello, stop Bits, darling, come on. Not, not in public. <laughs> oh, your own tail, huh? Oh, there we go. Oh, big yawn. Firing being this cute, isn't it? Firing. Why not? Oh, it's so warm. warm. Are you actually huge now? Do you remember the streams does where I brought her up here? She does cabbage, does cabbage, does cabbage. How big she? Oh. Hello, head. We need to go. Oh. So needy as well, like if we're downstairs. Oh, she's sitting. We're downstairs and um, 
And it's paused. Yeah, if we're downstairs, the paw comes up for like more attention. Here we go. Dragon, thank you for the 100 bits as well. Oh my god. Oh, big stretch with the bum in the air. Are you actually having a giggle? Cutie Nelly girl. Yes. I know. I know. I give you. Don't you? Oh, baby girl. Oh, you're so ugly. Easy today. Oh. Oh. Yeah, if I stop, see the paw. The paw is up. You like strokes, don't you, Bubba? And you're very needy. Are you so if I stop, the paw comes I'm onto the arm for more strokes. Or she gives kids a um. <laughs> you don't like when mummy stops giving you. Pick that part. You like the stroke part, but not the stop part. Got her little face. Dragon, thank you for the bits and Victoria for the bits as well. I can't fully see what you've given, but thank you Are for you the bits. She having a giggle. Can't stop the scritches now. Taz Carb Pizza, Taz Carb Pizza. And Kaz as well there, thank you. It's a bit big though, is it not a bit big? I can see that. <laughs> big. Thank you. Big, big, is it not big? Yeah, some hype in chat for deliverance with 1,000. 1,000 bits, thank you. Do you want a high five? Hi for deliverance? Yeah, good high fives. Um, Deliverance, thank you so much. That is so, so generous of you. Um, thank you for that. Big, big Deliverance shape type. Thank you. Um, and Kaz as well for those bits there. Thank you so much. Deliverance with the 1000, that's wild. But thank you for that. You're the good yeah, And you do. This is literally a daily occurrence you've got. The need for attention. <laughs> the point when I stop. A, a cuddly girl, a cuddly needy girl. I get it. I get it, babes. Oh, thanks, Cripply. Okay, Bubba. I'm... What are you off to? Stretch. Big stretch. She's having a sniff of you all. You get nice smells from everybody. Under my Moves. Aggressive gifts. Everyone. Hi everyone. You done now? Uh uh, need the pink rug. You can just see her tail, but she's currently on the pink rug. Uh uh. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Oh. Pink rugs. Right, I think she's done. <laughs> Is off out now. I don't know if she'll come back. Maybe. Um, thank you all so much for all of those bits and stuff, by the way. That's absolutely wild. Um, thank you. Oh, she's back. Hello, darling. Hello, baby girl. Hello, you're so cute. Hello, sweetness. Hello. Living old bed. You wanna sit on your old bed? Hey. 
Not the way some of me get it. Not the way. The sit on the bed. Good girl. There you go. That's your old bed, isn't it? Oh, she's off. She's out of the bed. <laughs> no, leave that. Thank you. Leave that. Bed. Oh, that's a wedding present for Auntie Lauren. Not for you. Uh -uh. Leave it, Bubba. Leave it. Oh, you can't box. Into bed. Bed. Into bed. Yes. Lie down. Good girl. <laughs> He's such a cheeky girl. I will, like, I do believe, hopefully, we'll get to the point eventually. I think I just need to get her used to this room a bit more. Where, yeah, eventually we can have her just in the background and, and chilling with us. So let me get rid of her. Hello, good girl. What now? Good girl. Good precious girl. Um, okay. I think we are gonna finish up there with 100 baby today. Um, so let me do a save. We've just done the CC makeovers and in the next episode, um, Amelia will be having the next baby. So um, if you did enjoy it, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Let me know down in the comments if you're excited for her to have another baby. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Take care, look after yourselves and I will see you next time.